We now know that four of the 78 dogs rescued from Lisa Cooper's home in January have died. As for the rest of the dogs, we're told their progress has been more positive. 13 on your side's Nate Belt has the story. Two weeks after being rescued from the house of Lisa Cober, Pound Buddy says the dogs that they've taken in have made a lot of progress. <laughs> but after two weeks of working with Pound Buddy's employees, they came in lethargic and coughing, uh, underweight, crusty nose, goopy eyes. They're starting to turn a corner. We have been in there with our staff, just literally just sitting with them and trying to be hands on with them, introducing the leash more, getting out in the yard and playing. Of the 78 dogs rescued, two each at Harbor Humane Society in Ottawa County and Muskegon Humane Society have died. Lana Carson at Pound Buddy says it's heartbreaking. These little underdogs, you want them to pull through and then experience the life that they should have had in the first place. And they won't be leaving the shelter for a while still. In Michigan, dogs are considered property, and this property still does not belong to us. Carson says the process of taking ownership of the dogs is underway, but until it's complete, they cannot be adopted. In the meantime, she's thankful for the outpouring of community support since the dogs have been rescued. People have just been absolutely generous and very concerned about this. We're, we're a community of pet lovers. Pound Buddy says the best way to stay updated on the progress of the dogs in their care is to follow them on their Facebook page. Reporting in Muskegon, Nate Belt, 13 on your side.